Given your current profession, the funniest bullet point on the resume has to be the color voice of Notre Dame football. Journalists have to be objective. USC alums do not. 2005, you're calling one of the greatest football games in the history of college football. What's going on inside as they're making that final drive? Well, you know, it was interesting. I remember because it was third and the longer third and 19, I think. And I think I said on the air they need to get it back in two chunks. Well, they've come back from off the ropes before, That's but right. this is as tough as it gets right now for the defending national champions. Third and 19, you have two downs to get 19 yards. I think the smart play is not trying to get the whole 19 here, Tom. I think you try to get eight to 10, maybe 12, and give yourself a chance on fourth down. Matt Leiter, good protection, completes the pass. Passes to Bush. And he stops short of the first down. It'll be fourth down coming up. So they got some of it back, and it comes up with a fourth and nine play. Uh, fourth and nine play, the perfect pass by uh, Liner to Jarrett. Oh, a tough time to audible. Liner on fourth down, in the pocket, goes down the sideline. It's caught. Jarrett just stopped short of the 10 yard line by Ambrose Wooden. Um, it was so improbable and so incredible. Liner going to try to sneak it ahead. He got in. Touchdown, SC! Believe me, during commercials, I'm always rooting for USC in, in, the, in the Notre Dame broadcast. Just on the air, I had to be an independent voice. But it was, uh, it was as good a, a game as I've ever broadcast. A fun game.